huge focus on occupational health and safety, but that would be a learning outcome of the program anyways. I would want them to be able to keep themselves safe on a contaminated site and actually feel better that the first contaminated site they're on, I'm there watching them, prying them off the side, saying don't touch that, don't smell that, don't, don't go near there. So it, in so many ways, it's so much more effective for me than just telling an abstract third party story to be there on site experiencing it with them. So most definitely, it requires a lot of the faculty in terms of vigilance and in terms of, of their agreement to be client ready at all times. I think they want to see this as practice sometimes, and I need a much higher level of performance in practice because we have a client with expectations on the other side of it. It's a ton of work, and it's much more difficult to meet deadlines. So one of the challenges in the course is that you have a teacher who's really planned what they plan on on day one, and then it's icy, so you have to cancel your trip, and then it's a snowstorm, and apologies can't go with you, you have to do it again. And so the project you planned to have due in week five now has to be due in week seven because you just simply physically couldn't get it done. A client may promise you something, and they do their best, but they're the client and they don't get it to you. So data that you promised the students is needed too when it comes to week seven. And so there is undoubtedly a much higher level of coordination and expectation placed on the faculty when they're dealing with the ill experience of education with clients. But the reward is the employability and stories of the students walking out of here in a job and the fact that I can claim as the program that it has the highest level of employee living in any program of its type and the fact that I have grads coming back and offering internships is, is absolutely the reward. For me, they've chosen to come back for an extra year, and if I can't get them employed after that, I feel like it's a failing of, of the program. And this is the single biggest thing that I can do 